Hi, this is Dr. Rob, and it's our health blog for this week. And this week, we want to discuss a little bit more about building health, okay, because some concepts on that. Because uh, you can think of health as kind of a bank account. So a lot of people, they just go in and they just keep withdrawing, withdrawing, withdrawing. And really, that's kind of like a symptomatic. Once you have a symptom and there's a problem, you go ahead and withdraw from your health account, and, and you keep doing that. So instead of be more proactive and start building your health. So some of, what are some of the ways that you can build your health? So first of all, a lot of people say you can eat right and you can exercise. Those are the most obvious ways that you can do that. And then some people, as far as stress reduction, uh, then some people would say, okay, some of those things like yoga, Pilates, the exercise. But then really, a lot of people miss the, the other part of it too. Because the thing that actually controls your body and controls your body, your, your whole body's ability to function, which is your brain, spinal cord, your nerve system. So your brain, spinal cord, and nerve system controls and coordinates all functions in the body, which means it's going to coordinate your immune system, your cardiovascular system, your ability to, to function throughout the day. So you'd want to have a good nerve supply to all those organs. And one way that you can do that is through ha having regular chiropractic adjustments. So building a bank account of health means that you'd be allowing the spine, all these nerve channels in the spine, to stay freed up to all the organs so you can have 100% nerve flow to those organs. So that means for you and your kids and your family. So if you're thinking about building health, it's just not going to come from your insurance policy. It's going to come from doing other things. So one of them, like we were talking about, the eating right and exercising. But the other one is getting regular chiropractic checkups. Because you are, there's a saying that said that you are as old as your spine. And that's very true. Because people that have older spines, they may be 25 years old and their spine is aging faster. And they're going to act like someone who's 60. So you want to take care of that spine. So again, regular chiropractic checkups and uh, to eliminate the nerve interference so your brain can communicate uh, to the sorry. rest of the body. Yes. If you have any questions, you can talk to me at my, uh, for my office, Bates Chiropractic, at 310-545-4188, or you can contact us on the web at chiropractormanhattanbeach.com. And if you want to pass this on, I would appreciate you spreading the word to other people. You can pass this video blog on to your friends, too, so they can start building the the, the wealth to other people uh, and building their health accounts. Okay, have a great day. We'll see you next week.